I'm going to walk you through the process of adding an uplink adapter, better known as a NIC, to a vSphere standard switch using the vSphere web client. By the end of this video, you'll have a better understanding of how to add a NIC to your standard switch. You can add multiple NICs to a standard switch to facilitate NIC teaming. NIC teaming combines multiple network connections to increase throughput and provide redundancy. Essentially, the NIC team shares network traffic and provides failover. To add a NIC to your vSphere standard switch, browse to a host. On the Hosts Manage tab, click Networking and then Virtual Switches. A list of the standard and distributed switches attached to the host is displayed in a table. Select the standard switch you want to add a NIC to and click Manage Physical Network Adapters. Click Add. The Add Physical Adapters window opens. Select a network adapter from the list and then assign it to a failover group using the drop-down menu. You can assign it to active, standby, or unused adapters. For this video, I'll put the NIC in the standby adapters group. Click OK. The adapter appears in the selected failover group list in the assigned adapters table. You can use the up and down arrows to change the position of an adapter in the failover groups if needed. Use the tabs to the right of the table to view configuration information for each NIC. Click OK to add the NIC to the standard switch. To verify that the NIC was added to the standard switch, select the standard switch from the table and examine the topology of the switch. You can see that the adapter has been added and that it is in standby mode. Now that you've added a virtual network adapter to your standard switch, you can create a NIC team to share network traffic and provide redundancy. For more information on NIC teaming, visit pubs.vmware.com.